Now that Mr. Foltz is covered in tar, we are ready to drop those feathers on him. But you'll notice a, a kind of a problem. I can't really see Mr. Foltz, so I'm going to temporarily select this tar. Now keep in mind when we actually play the animation, when this is a movie, at this point, uh, that tar won't be visible because we did that animation wiping it out. Um, but right now it's, it's there. So we kind of have to deal with it temporarily right now. So what I'm going to do is select that tar and go to the paintbrush. And then under arrange, what I'm going to do is just move that tar to the back just so I can kind of see where I want those feathers to drop. And I'm going to change that um, back when I'm done here. All right, so now let's select these feathers. And right now they're off of the slide. I'm going to select them, get the, the menu up, go to animate. And we're going to animate those feathers kind of dropping down. So we're going to do an, an action. And we're going to create a path. And with my finger, I'm going to move those feathers kind of in the path that they are going to fall. And since feathers are light, they kind of just drift down. Yep, just like that. So we'll make them fall down onto Mr. Foltz. Just like that. And as you can see by that preview, that was kind of a little bit fast for, for you know, light feathers. So I'm going to select on that motion path again. And this time, maybe increase that duration so that this happens. Oops a little bit more slowly. Yeah, like that. All right, so that's good. Um, now the last thing that we need to do before we end, we do want that, when that tar falls on Mr. Foltz, we do want that to cover him up. So I'm gonna select the tar one more time, go up to the paintbrush, and we're going to move that to the front like that. 